This video is going to explain how to do a Google Slides assignment from Schoology and then how to upload the completed assignment back to Schoology. This process will require seven steps, which you will learn how to do by following this video. You may need to use Google Slides for some of your assignments. The first time you use it, you're going to have to use your NetID and your password to sign into the app. This will connect the app to your email account and to your Google Drive. My app is already signed in. In this Schoology assignment, I can see that I need to download a document and it happens to be a slides document, but even if I don't know that, it's going to automatically take care of that for me. But I need to find the attachment. Up here, underneath the title of the assignment, I can see View Attachments, and when I touch that, it's going to show me the assignment that needs to be downloaded, and I'm going to touch that. Now you can see that it's booting up my app, and I can see the activity right here. Now, this is the master copy. What I'm going to need to do is make my own personal copy that I can mess around with. So to do that, I'm going to touch the three little dots over on the top left-hand side, and I'm going to touch where it says share and export. And down at the bottom of this list, you can see make a copy. And that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to make a copy. It's going to take just a second. And once it does this, then I'm going to see the name of my document is copy of Bio 504 Mitosis Puzzle Activity, and it's ready for me to use. So most of our slides activities are cut and paste activities. You can see that there are four different pages, and every time I touch a page, you can see the different kinds. This is where the puzzles are going to go. These are the puzzle pieces. To move the puzzle pieces, what I need to do is touch the puzzle piece that I'm interested in moving. And in this case, I need to move it to a different page. So I'm going to use the menu to cut that out. And then I'm going to go to the page that I would like it to go on, touch the page so that I can see the paste menu, and then I'm gonna paste it in place. You can see how it's highlighted. So I'm gonna pick it up with my finger and I'm going to move it to the puzzle. Then I just touch the page again where the puzzle pieces are, and then I can find the next piece that I wanna move. Again, the menu shows up, I cut it, I touch the page that I want it to go to, and I touch that page again so I can see the menu, I paste it in place, and I move it to where I want it to go. And I'm gonna continue doing that until my entire puzzle is done. So now that my puzzle is finished, I need to do the reflection. To do that, I am gonna double tap on the spot where it says reflection. You can see that it brings up a menu bar and it also brings up the keyboard so that I can type. Now, once my entire assignment is done, now it's time for me to submit this. In order to submit my assignment, I am going to touch on the three dots up in the corner and I'm going to share and export. And what I want to do is I want to send a copy. So I'm gonna send a copy and it is very important that it's in the right format. I want it to be a PDF so that it can be submitted to Schoology. So you can see the check mark there is for PDF. So I'm gonna to touch okay. It's gonna prepare the PDF for me and then it's gonna give me some options for where I want it to go. Now, I want it to go to Schoology, so I'm gonna move this until I see Copy to Schoology, and I'm going to touch that. And what it's gonna do is it's going to attach itself to Schoology, and it's going to allow me to submit it to the assignment. So here's my biology class, so I'm gonna to touch my biology class, and I can see the Friday Mitosis Puzzle Activity. So I'm gonna to touch that, and it's gonna say, is this what you want to do? You want it to go to this? And I'm going to say yes by touching upload. It's going to take just a moment to upload it and then it's going to say my submission has been added. Now I can double check that that's true by touching submissions up at the top and you can see my submissions. I have a copy of Bio 504 Mitosis Puzzle Activity right there and my assignment is done. These are the written instructions for what we just went over in the video. If you feel like you need some additional help, don't hesitate to ask your teacher.